Hi guys, before we get started, I want to thank all my subscribers for subscribing to my channel, for supporting me. Thank you so much. We're not a lot, but I know that we're going to get there. Um, my goal is to reach to 100 subscribers and eventually I know I'm going to get there. But I want to let you guys know that it means too much that you guys are still here supporting me. It's almost going to be a year that I started my YouTube channel and i want to thank you again and let's get started for an, for this video hi guys welcome to christy and fans channel welcome to another video this video is going to be about how i seal these tumblers this is a starbucks tumblers 24 ounce as you guys can see uh, i already did the hole i already put my glitter and my polyester these are the gorilla dots the ones i'm gonna be using it has 150 and this is the epoxy glue. Some people use it. I don't like using it. I tried it the first time, but it didn't work for me. So now this is my resin. This is my alcohol. The glitter, the polyester. So here I'm gonna be spraying my tumbler with alcohol and cleaning it with a napkin softly. So the glycerin will come out. I'm going to be removing my tape with my sticky note. Once I remove that, I am going to spray it with alcohol again and cleaning it with the napkin softly to remove anything that is on my tumbler like glitter or any glycerin that came out. After I left it here for three hours, I am going to spin the tumbler to see if I see any bubbles. Like I don't see any bubbles or the glycerin coming out. I am ready to put my glue dots. This is the way they come. So I'm gonna be cutting. They come three in a line and I wrote. So I'm gonna be cutting them in pieces. I don't think you guys will be able to see it. It's really clear. I wanted you guys to see the dot so I'm touching it with my finger and if you don't have anything of glycerin coming out it's ready so I'm just gonna place the dot right over the hole press it down and quickly pull that out sometimes it's hard and it will come off again so just get your crooked well I'm getting my crooked tool to pull it down and there we go. I'm just gonna press it down with my tool. I am gonna be putting the second one. I gotta remove it carefully, quickly and carefully so it won't come off. And with my Cricut tool, I am going to press it down all over. Here I come with the third one. I like to put three, anybody could put one, two, or three, or even up to four. It's up to you guys, but I like to be safe and sorry. And again, I'm gonna be removing it quickly. And with the Cricut tool, I am going to press it down. I am going to touch it to see if nothing's coming out. Here I come with resin next, and I'm going to add a thin layer I'm gonna start in the glue dot then go all the way around I will be spinning the tumbler so the resin can touch all the edges of the cup and then I'm gonna go and put it under the lamp the UV lamp for 60 seconds And this UV resin has a smell, so I suggest for you to not do it around kids. I don't know if you guys can see the smoke coming out. After it's done, touch it. Don't overdo it with the putting another layer of resin if it's ready because it will create bumps and it won't sit straight when you're trying to stand your cup up. Here I am shaking it. So you guys can see how beautiful it looks. 
this is how the cup looks like after it's done this is how i seal the tumblers i will be making another video on how i do my lids for my tumblers and if you want to watch the video go ahead and subscribe and click on the notification bell so you don't miss out thank you for watching this video and if you guys are interested on this tumbler it will be on my shop i'll be leaving all the links down below on the things that i use to seal my tumblers thank you for watching this video bye